Hello all, I'm Blame Truth the Codfather, and I am fucking pissed off. I, I want to open up this video with just an image, a still image here, because I, I want to cover this image, and I want to cover the timeline of events that happened last night before I get into my rant and volume warning. I will be yelling, I will be screaming, so make sure you're not in a public location, a library, a church, make sure you're not at a bar mitzvah, whatever. You know, put put your headphones on, or turn the volume down, whatever, because I will be yelling very soon. But if you look at this image, it, it's a simple image. But you see that the ammunition there for my Expedite 12 is locked. The ammunition, like, not attachment, but just the ability to put ammunition on my gun is locked. And it's level 28. And I, I had just unlocked Dragon's Breath. I wanted to put it on, and then I couldn't, because it's still locked in the gunsmith. So, I'm like, okay, uh, when does this unlock? And I asked Twitter, and nobody really had an answer. I googled it, I couldn't find anything. And I'm like, why is the UI this fucking bad, right? Let's get into the gameplay now. But someone on Twitter was kind enough to give me sort of an answer. But it's the most backwards fucking answer ever. And we're, we're going to get more into, like, this fucking failure of a game as we progress. But I just want to give you this as an example. So I spend like 30 minutes trying to figure out how to just put Dragon's Breath on my Expedite 12, right? That's all I've been using. All I've been using. I just want to level it up because I like it. And Doyle was kind enough on Twitter to say, Have you looked at the weapon progression screen for that weapon? Maybe the ammunition unlocks with another shotgun, then maybe it's available. And I did do that, and I didn't see anything like that. So then he says, Either that, or it's a bug. If you plug a mouse into your Xbox and hover over that locked symbol, it will tell you when it unlocks. So I'm like, wow, why do I have to fucking do that? Why is the UI so fucking bad? That I have to plug in a mouse into my console in 2022 to see when this unlocks. It's not an attachment, it's the ability to put Dragon's Breath on my fucking gun in the gunsmith. There's no indication when I that becomes available to me. There's no indication when any of these like attachment slots in the gunsmith become available to me. There's no way to fucking know. I'm just playing and using the weapon, and I'm like, wow, I have this nearly maxed out. I still don't have the ability to use ammunition. So I go to my box of wires and other miscellaneous nerd shit, and I, I whip out my old Logitech mouse, still going strong like six, seven years later. They don't make them like they used to, yada, yada. Back in my day, I walked 15 miles in the fucking snow, barefoot, y you know, that whole spiel, but it's true. Like, seven, eight-year-old Logitech mouse, it's, it's old, it still works. I plug it in the console. I hover over the lock screen, and what I see horrifies me! Do you know what it is? Look at this shit! Unlock by leveling Expedite 12 to level one. My gun is level 28! I spend hours trying to figure out how to equip Dragon's Breath, which I unlocked, and I get this. Guys, I'm not making any of this up. I'm not exaggerating. I have a witness here right now. I, <laughs> I spent hours. I plugged a mouse into my console because the UI is so fucking shit. I can't just see it with my controller and I get told something that doesn't make fucking sense. This entire game does not make fucking sense. I have been playing the past couple days, right? I'm trying to find any positive whatsoever with this shitty fucking game, and I have determined that there basically is none. This is the biggest fucking fail in Call of Duty history. If you think I'm just mad because of this attachment bug or the fact that there's a shitty UI, it's more than that. All the maps fucking suck. Some of the maps are taken away because the devs literally stole locations! 3,000 devs! And they steal locations! And they get busted for copyright! Activision is like that guy uploading songs to YouTube back in 2008. 
and then they come out with the copyright thing, and then like he gets his channel banned. What the fuck? We are missing that hotel map from the beta. We are missing weapons that were promised to us. We are missing that raceway map in most modes. I haven't seen it at least. They literally stole locations <laughs> and didn't get permission. And we, the consumer, are punished for it. There's no combat record. There's no challenges to complete. As far as I know, party play still doesn't fucking work right. There's no progression. There's no- there's nothing. There's nothing but a frustrating fucking bad time. This is a- this is- this is the biggest fucking fail in Call of Duty history. You know, when Vanguard came out, that game sucked my fucking asshole through a straw. It did. It sucked so goddamn bad. And I tried to tell you, don't buy it. It sucks. Right? But there was no expectation for it. Th th there were no expectations. Did anyone have expectations for that game to be good? No. Everyone pretty much thought it was going to be shit. Maybe they were pleasantly surprised when it initially launched because it did have, like, a potential when it initially launched. It was bad. But then, you know, Sledgehammer dropped the ball like they usually do because they fucking suck. And, and whatever. You know, like, it's a shitty filler COD game. Fine. But this game... Hyped up! They sucked their own fucking dick until they came dust! <laughs> That's the sound of their own cocks not having any, any cum left. You know, like, like seriously, they're just emitting dust. I read so many articles about this being the most advanced Call of Duty of all time. Mwah, mwah, mwah. What is fucking advanced about it? It's advancing my blood pressure. It's advancing me closer to the fucking grave. Nothing in this game is good. The perk system sucks. The maps suck. The progression sucks. I have to use like four different weapons just to get a fucking 74U unlocked. Joe Secott has deleted his Twitter because he knows the game sucks. Doors, campy, safe spaces, skill-based matchmaking, nothing to play for. What the fuck is this fucking shitty ass game? 3,000 deaths! Three years! Three years to come up with this! This is like a shitty fucking mod made by two stoner kids in their basement over the course of six months. That's the quality of this game. It's a mod of Modern Warfare 2019, but fucking worse in every way! And from what I have heard, they're actually taking content away from Modern Warfare 2019. I'm not kidding. If people are still playing that, can you verify in the comment section? And then if you guys see it, you know, like thumb it up or something so I can see it and I don't miss it. But they're taking content away from Modern Warfare 2019. Like they're taking maps out of fucking rotation. Oh, there's no hardcore mode. How could I forget? We were promised that. They were hyping that up. Tier 1 or whatever the fuck they're calling it. Tier fucking nothing because we don't have it. Oh my god, I'm so fucking pissed. I... I I did not expect it to be this bad. Clearly, I should have expected worse. I made a video saying this is this is probably going to be the worst Call of Duty of all time. But, like, I want to be proven wrong, right? Like, I don't want a bad Call of Duty to release. But I, I have to just ask, who the fuck enjoys this shit? Yes, like, the core shooting mechanics? Uh, like, when I shoot someone, it feels good. That's fun. That resembles a game, you know? But, God, I fucking hope that feels good because they've had 20 years to perfect it, you know? But when I think back to it, like, it felt the fucking same in Modern Warfare 2019. So why wouldn't I just play that? Yeah, the map sucked in that, but at least we have, like, a complete game now, I think, unless they're taking shit away. I don't fucking know. I'm about to pull my hair out, man. You know, I, I'm, I decided I'd be Jack Torrance for Halloween. Jack Torrance from The Shining. I feel like Jack Torrance now on Halloween. I feel like I'm going insane playing this shitty fucking game. And they charge 10 more dollars. I, I still can't believe that. They charge us 10 more dollars for this. I, slap in the face! All these stupid pronoun slinging, Prius driving ninnies that worked on this game should be ashamed. 
like if it's this easy to get into into gaming now like to be a game developer nowadays let me in seriously can i be the fucking design director over over all the games like literally just get me ace and nero we could literally make a better fucking cod game with a team of independent devs than this shit just give us like the cod engine I do not understand. I, I seriously do not understand. And these games, they have not gotten much more advanced, guys. Th this game is the same game as Modern Warfare 2019. Which, really, I mean, Call of Duty hasn't changed that much. The graphics get better. The animations get better. Nothing else really changes. How are they still fucking it up? They have the blueprints! Of the last 20 years! Why do all the maps suck? There's like one good map, man. And it was in the beta, that that like street map. They named the maps like convoluted bullshit now. I can't even remember what they're fucking called. What was wrong with Favela? You know? What was wrong with Backlot? Raid. Why is why is there a map called like the, the Saskatchewan spinning nerve hold hydroelectric? That just rolls off the tongue, doesn't it? Or how about the, the Santa Sima 7-Eleven border crossing? Fuck off! Name your maps like one word! Make them good! Just bring back old maps! And like you recycle everything else! Bring back good maps at least! It's like all the dev time just went to overcomplicating how to unlock stuff. I, I feel like I'm trying to solve the goddamn like Zodiac killing riddle. I'm, I'm trying to figure out how the Zodiac is or something. I feel like Infinity Ward's the Unabomber. And I gotta decipher some fucking code or some shit. Look at this. Seriously, on Reddit, someone had to make a spreadsheet to show how to unlock all the stuff in the game. Why is it this available to us from the devs? Do the devs even know how to unlock their own fucking shit? I feel like I'm playing Where's Waldo or something. No, that's an insult to Waldo, that striped shirt wearing bastard. <laughs> it's more convoluted than that. I, I, all, all this sandwiched into this Hulu light UI. I'm not looking for something to watch. I'm not looking for a show starring Jason Momoa. No, I'm trying to use a 74U. I'm trying to put fire ammunition on my shotgun. And I have to navigate Hulu light. Modern Hulu. Guys. I am out of time. I I'm out of time. Literally <laughs> and figuratively. I'm out of time. If you are still on the fence about buying this game, I, I hope I convinced you to stay the fuck away. Don't even wait until season one. Th there are so many people out there still saying, like, give them time. Those same people said, it's just a beta. It's just a beta. Three fucking years they have no more time for me no no more time their time is fucking up i'm going to go i don't know man i'm gonna go drink it's halloween i'm gonna get drunk before the trick-or-treaters come <laughs> i hope you guys enjoyed rate comment and subscribe ring that notification bell i want to suplex joe Secott through literally anything i can find peace I appreciate it, Nick. I'm sorry if I'm a little fucking snippy. I'm hurt and I'm old and I'm fucking tired and I work with fucking children.